All right, today I'll show you guys how to install the tilt limiter and forward tilt function on a Herman Miller Aeron Classic. Um, this is what the new pieces look like um, directly from Herman Miller. Um, so this is the forward tilt and tilt limiter um, function. You only need two tools. You need a screwdriver, Phillips screwdriver, and um, a pliers. Now I already went ahead and removed the previous um, cover on this side. All it is is a Phillips Phillips uh, screw. So just remove that and, and you're good to start. So after you have this piece removed, you can go ahead and put the new piece on. It just slides right in, just like that. And then go ahead and put the screw back in and tighten it up. All right, so now we can go ahead and put our two knobs on. They just pop right into place. If for some reason you do need to take them off, um, they come off pretty easily. You just take the screwdriver underneath it and just kind of pop it off like that. Now you will notice right away that the wires don't really do anything or move. Um, that's because you do not have it attached to anything, which is normal. So now we will go ahead and attach the geese on here. Okay, first we are going to be attaching the tilt limiter, um, which is the one here that looks like an L. Um, and this simply just goes into this groove right, right there that you can see. Um, so... Let's just put it right in there. And put it down like that. And that's all it is. Um, now you also want to remember that you do have to attach this cable um, and mount it here. Otherwise, it's not going to work. So the easier way is to push it in like that. And once that is done, that should work just like that. Okay, so now we will mount the forward tilt. Go ahead and put it into a little catcher there. Next, we will want to grab this cord with our pliers. And insert it into this hole, which is easiest by using the pliers. Just like that. And then that is good to go.